A breath of freshness and renewal blows over the accessories of the House of Chopin. In Cannes, at the Hotel Martinez, the jeweler presented, among other sumptuous jewels, some innovations worthy of creating an effect on the red carpet, but also to face any other glittering and distinguished photo call. You may not know it, but the Cannes Film Festival is a crucial step for the celebrity jeweler. First, because the Chopin house is the creator of the famous Palm Door, a prize that in 2019 was awarded to South Korean filmmaker Bong Joon-ho for his film Parasite, a classic Palm Award that's certainly worthy of its reputation this year, thanks to a few minor details. What changes every year is the rock crystal that it's placed on, which makes it unique because it depends on the part of crystal that was chosen by the artisan to shape it. This year, there are many materials, there is a lot of life, so it was specially supplied actually, compared to last year where the crystal was much more transparent. We're still using fair mined 18 karat gold. Since 2014, we have made the Palme d'Or out of fair mined 18 karat gold, and I'm not sure you've seen on the bottom, a little heart has been added by Chopard. During this little visit to the suite dedicated to the house of Chopin on the top floor of the Hotel Martinez, it was a perfect chance to also discover the exclusivity of some breathtaking finery, including these show-stopping emeralds. So here's a piece from the Red Carpet Collection. The Red Carpet Collection is the Haute Joyerie Collection that is launched at Cannes every year, only with unique pieces, all of which have been inspired and thought out for the Red Carpet, for the festival stair climb and for the actresses. So they're often quite different, because women and actresses are all different. Caroline Schoeffler, when she creates them, thinks of actresses she likes, of people she would like to see wearing the design. Bollywood actress, singer and former Miss World 2000, Priyanka Chopra, and her husband Nick Jonas from the Jonas Brothers group were also seduced by some breathtaking pieces, as we discover in these images. Not to mention the glittering choices of actresses Stacey Martin, Amber Heard, Andy McDowell, and all those who'll make their mark in the world of glamour. The youngest juror in the history of the festival, Elle Fanning, marked the history of fashion with her choice of finery that was perfectly in keeping with her wardrobe. Not forgetting Sir Elton John, who wore Chopard jewellery for the premiere of Rocket Man, as did the actor who plays him in the film that retraces his life, and actress Julianne Moore, faithful to the brand, chose to accessorize all her looks with brilliance. So many fine jewelry pieces that we can discover in images. Here, it's fine jewelry with emeralds and diamonds. Pair cut Colombian emeralds, so it's an assortment of Colombian emeralds. And diamonds that are RJC, from suppliers that are RJC certified, the Responsible Jewelry Council. You never know who will wear the finery until they are on the red carpet, because there are a lot of last-minute changes, depending on the dresses, the mood of the moment. Often, in fact, when we send photos in advance, and in the photo, in fact, is the piece. You really have to see it in real life to realize its effect. To see a necklace, how it fits on the body, around the neck, all of those details come into play. So it's often at the last moment when the actresses get dressed that they make the final choice. As these are pieces that are still intended to be sold, not only to be worn, they have to be comfortable for the woman who will wear them. It is a specificity of Chopin, as it is a woman who designs them. She wears her pieces herself to these events, to make sure they are very comfortable, flexible. The structure in gold must have a certain flexibility and not be rigid or unpleasant, not too heavy when worn. We use a lot of titanium, for example, which is a material that is quite difficult to work because it is very hard, but it allows us to have lighter pieces. For example, for earrings, it's very useful, so we don't have items that are too heavy to wear. Spotlight also on this innovation from Chopin presented at Cannes, a handbag created in collaboration with an American actress who is always at the forefront of trends, Chloe Sevigny, with the advice of Livia Firth, the founder of the EcoAge Consulting Agency and the initiator of the Green Carpet Challenge the challenge of going green on red carpets. Here, Chopin is focused on accessories, and not just any, the green carpet collection bag. 
We have had an accessories line for several years, but there are two particularities. In fact, this is the first time we made a bag with eco-friendly leather. It is a leather that is completely traceable to the field that we sought out with Livia Firth, with whom we work a lot and who advises us on everything that is sustainable. And the other specialty? We asked actress Chloé Sévigny to design it with Caroline Schäufele. It's quite different from what we usually do. Our accessories are something that we sell in our shops, but we don't really talk about them much. But there is this eco-responsible approach, because in fact, Chloé Sévigny is also very committed. She's very sensitive to all things sustainable. And then there's the very sharp, very fashionable Chloé Sévigny, and we found that really interesting, so we were very happy when she agreed to do this project with us. Wonderful collaborations on the red carpet at Cannes because we can't forget that Chopin is a true partner of the festival for many years now, being the sponsors of the Amphar Gala, the Chopin Trophy, and the Chopin Gentleman's Evening. It's really a passion, I would say, and we grew up together. And in 1998, when we started, it wasn't the same volume at all for Chopin. In terms of fine jewelry, for example, the house was not at all where it is today. Today, we have one of the largest in-house fine jewellery workshops in Switzerland. So we've evolved a lot too. Everything we do at the Cannes Film Festival has become so much more important. We are inviting more people and the festival has also become more glamorous at the same time, thanks to Chopard and the finery on the red carpet.